Alright boys, Genius 2 version 200. This video is going to be dedicated to my old buddy, YouTuber Southern Relics Adventures. We're going to use an Indian head penny. You see it laying over there so low. These nails, I'm going to leave these nails as they are. You'll see them in that position for the entire video. I am in the bird dog setup with sensitive FT. This is zero. I have a notch of zero two to zero seven, a silencer of one. We are in full tones. We'll leave this machine in full tones. So, I'm coming over them nails with that call there. You hear what we hear, right? The sharpshooter can't guarantee what every nail in the world is going to sound like with this setup, okay? I'm just going to give you this little demo here. Others can follow along. And we're going to be looking at conventional setup on this, okay? I'm going to turn the camera off here and get this set up. All right, that old Indian head is in there, boys and girls. And we have got this machine at sensitive FT 6.8 discs. The sides are still at one. It will remain at one in this video. Full tones. Zero notch. Now, I have set that up so the traditional program will actually hit that Indian head. But I want you to notice when I compare it, okay, what we have to do to hear that Indian head. From over here... L Zippo walking through in a relic site, four inches of call height, three inches of call height. That's what you're going to hear. You're not going to hear anything but iron tone. Okay, now we're coming over here. That's a pretty fast sweep right there, huh? How about if I slow down? Hear that? Back to call up. So right there. I get that signal right there. Back to call up farther, I lose it. So I've got just a very, very small span of detection there. And I have to... See how fast I'm sweeping? Nothing. Slow down. Hear that? So if I'm in a relic site, I could find that Indian head. But I would have to hit that baby just right and with a slow sweep. Okay, you see that? Look. That's not an ultra fast sweep right there. Slow down. Creeper. And I have to have the call in the right position to boot. So sweep speed. Sweep speed and call position are real key to hit that old Indian head running 6.8 disc silencer 1 sensitive FT. Now Southern Relics Adventure says he needs to hear the iron. Well, okay, well you can do that. You see the results there, okay? Now watch what happens here, okay? We're running the disc to zero. Now I've done swept those nails solo. With the settings you're fixing to see in this detector. Silence or disc of zero point zero, the notch. Notch. Let me get this right here. I got it sort of Messed up. There's a two through seven notch. The silencer hasn't changed. The tones haven't changed. The offset, I've dialed to 20. Like I said, we swept the nail solo with these setups at the first part of this video. All right? You hear that? So I'm coming through a relic site with these settings. And I hear that. Remember what we got from over here with the conventional settings? You hear that? So I hear that in the old relic site. And I'm like, hmm, turn on it, sweep, slow down the call. Hear that signal? 
We never did get audio, even with a slow sweep, as good as we're getting on that Indian head with conventional settings. So look at the call sweep speed. See that? How about from over here with a faster sweep? Well, that's the bird dog, okay? It gets you on something that could be holding a non-ferrous target. Back the call up. Hear that signal? That's about where we got the best signal with that conventional program. Listen to that signal. Okay, so a little demo there for my old buddy.